why you won't hear from the narcissist anymore. It can be very confusing when the narcissist suddenly disappears because they leave you without any closure. They leave you without an explanation. But what you need to understand is that narcissists are performers. They're entertainers. They're only there to amuse or interest you. And that's as far as it goes. It can never be anything more than that. But they may have led you to believe that you were building a relationship together. When in reality, you were just their audience, while they were a performer or an entertainer. Because they gain pleasure and satisfaction from your reactions to what they do to you. They put on a show. But it's only for attention, validation, admiration and praise. That's all that it's for. Because to them that's worth more than anything else. It's worth more than money. So all they really want is to be seen. They just want you to acknowledge their existence. So that they can feel powerful and in control. But then they suddenly disappear. They suddenly don't want to deal with you anymore. Or they start doing things more slowly. Or with less energy than before. Because they already know they're not captivating you. They already know they're not capable of attracting you or holding your interest. By being exciting, pleasant or attractive. Which is why they will remove themselves. They will stop what they're doing and leave. Because they already know what's coming. You've already let on that you're not interested in them. You've already revealed information. You've questioned and confronted them on their bad behavior. You've reflected their insecurities back to them. So they don't want to go for the full effect of being rejected by you. Because you've unknowingly rejected them already. You rejected them first. And it triggered them. It caused a narcissistic injury. So they know it's only a matter of time until you get rid of them. They're anticipating it. Because you've already let on that their act isn't inviting, attractive, tempting or enticing anymore. And all they ever were is a performer or an entertainer. And they pay very close attention to you as their audience. They're very aware. They're very observant. And they're very self-conscious. So they're constantly paying close attention to your body language, facial expressions and tone of voice. They already know exactly what you think of them, even if you don't say anything. They recognize when you were initially deeply involved. But they also recognize that your emotional responses weren't the same as they were in the beginning. They recognize that it lost the intensity and the effect that it once had. Because it was no longer fulfilling for them. It no longer gave them fuel. So when they started to see that they were no longer having an effect on you, they felt that and it affected them. Because you weren't giving them any praise or attention. You weren't giving them anything to encourage them to keep going. And they're just a performer or an entertainer. So they understand that if you're not reacting the same way as you did before, then it's time for them to leave. So they will remove themselves. They will ghost you. They will discard you. Because you've discovered something unappealing about them. Or you're just not reacting to them in the same way as you did before. 
you're not giving them an emotional response so that they're not receiving that same energy from you because they don't appeal to you as they did when they first met you when everything they did made you feel good and you were giving them your appreciation and emotions because that's what motivates them to continue but they're insatiable they always need more which is why it's inevitable that at some point they will remove themselves because their act becomes negative, boring and mundane it begins to lack interest and excitement it becomes dull because they abuse their position of power over you even though you may have feelings for them or you may love them they use it against you they abuse it until you begin to feel differently about them and you begin to react differently to them and that is when they have to get rid of you or they will just push you away or they will just disappear on their own because they know what's coming they know it's not having an effect on you anymore and once they realize that they no longer desire you or want to be with you because they know it's only a matter of time until you get rid of them and they're very sensitive to rejection so they'd rather be on the other side of it they'd rather be the one who can say that they discarded you or that they pushed you away or that they never wanted you anyway because you weren't good for them they will always have some excuse but the reality is that they disrespected you they damaged the relationship so they know that they have to leave they know that they have to end their performance because their act has become boring and mundane and they can see that you've gotten tired of it they can see that it doesn't stimulate you so they know that it's like an interest and excitement because then it doesn't stimulate them it doesn't give them fuel because you're not responding too readily you're not easily excited by them you just see them as something unpleasant and offensive so even if you choose to stay they know it's only because you don't want to lose the time that you've wasted they know that you're annoyed and happy and bored of them they know that you're about to get rid of them because they pay very close attention to your facial expression, body language and tone of voice so that they can get an advance warning of your next move and then they will know when it's time for them to discard you or to start being mean and disrespectful to you so that they can say that it happened in the conditions that they decided because they're in a position of power rather than it being because of you it makes it easier for them to deal with it rather than them having to accept that you didn't want them but that's the reality of it you trigger the discard because they know they're just a performer or an entertainer and if their act isn't good enough they have to walk off the stage Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Share your thoughts in the comment section. Hit the subscribe button to receive the notifications. If you would like to support the channel, you can donate at paypal.me slash narcsurvivor. You can book a one-on-one -on -one with me on my website. It's narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.